Hello, I'm Matt and welcome to Badger Workshop. So I've had this Urbauer biscuit joiner for a couple of years now. I wanted to give you my thoughts on it and my thoughts on just using a biscuit joiner in general. Now for me, it's definitely not an essential tool, but it's very nice to have sometimes. So what it's great for is gluing up panels made out of several bits of wood. It really helps keep them aligned and flat while you're gluing and clamping them together. And it certainly makes life a lot easier doing that, but it's not essential and you can achieve the same thing in other ways, but it's probably more of a faff. So the other thing I found it useful for is gluing things up where you don't want fixing showing. Now I made this little camera display shelf a few years ago and I used these to align the boards. So you can't see any fixings and it doesn't really hold much weight and doesn't need to be that strong. Now I mentioned strength because there's some great videos out there demonstrating that biscuit joints maybe aren't the strongest thing and can even weaken a joint. So they're definitely not as useful for strength as in a screw, a tenon, a dowel would be, but they are really good for aligning things. So biscuit joints work by having a spinning blade that cuts a slot in both bits of wood. Then a biscuit can be inserted. These come in different sizes going up from zero to 10 to 20. And I've always found the biggest ones, the number 20 is the most useful. So you mark it on both bits of wood, then you can set the plunge depth depending on what size biscuit you want to use, and then plunge in. Now the markings on this machine don't look that accurate and that worried me at first but actually because you have a bit of sideways play in a biscuit which is really good for aligning things it didn't matter that much. So I got this machine because it's pretty much the cheapest one on the market. The Urbau brand is available at Screwfix and a lot of times I buy a cheap tool and then if I like using it I upgrade to something better but as the biscuit joint is so simple I've never felt the need to upgrade it. You can align it on the board using a couple of different techniques. You can use the fence, which can be angled, but I've only ever used it in 90, I think. And then you can reference the top of the board, or it's got this flat base. And if you've got a nice flat work surface, you can run it on that. And you can put packers of six or nine or 12 mil sheet goods underneath to raise it up and get the height you want. I've used both techniques and they both work well. It comes with this dust port and a dust bag I've never used the bag, I always tend to hook up the vacuum to it. And maybe the one complaint I've got about this is the dust port, but I'm really nitpicking here. It pushes in and sometimes with the weight of the hose, it can pull out. Now, this could easily be fixed by just wrapping a bit of tape around, so it's not a major problem. So in summary, not an essential tool for me anyway, but I'm pleased I've got it, and this cheap Urbau one has done everything I want it to do. So thanks for watching, thanks to my patrons, and please subscribe for more videos.